राधे 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 गोविंद राधे गुरवे गौड़चंद्राय राधिकाय स्तालय कृष्णाय कृष्ण भक्ताय सद्भक्ताय नमो नम बद्धे बिदनुते भक्ति मूर्खमावर्त श्रुति यत्कृपाम वंदे श्रीमदन गोपाल प्रभु बोल जय रिता भजन शिक्षा कथा टुडे विल स्टार्ट डेली प्रैक्टिस एट द मॉर्निंग टाइम फर्स्ट वे टू वेक अप सर्वकर्म निष्पालन तिलक Or your twelve places. Minimum, you need four head tilak. And it is essential when during your anhing, you must put tilak on your twelve places. First year four head, now one second, third, fourth. नावल पोर्सन फिंगर Middle finger we can use for tilak, and index finger we can use for tilak. By this three, <coughs> we'll get three result. If we put tilak by ring finger, it will bring you paramayu. Paramayu lifetime. Long, long, long life, long life health. Health, well, good health. By middle finger, it will brings you siddhis. The perfection. And by the index finger, it will brings bhakti moksha. So that is why we are using this index finger because we need bhakti. We have no need of long lifetime or siddhis. If Krishna is not there, so what we should do with this long life? So that is good to use the index finger for your tilak. So after you put tilak. Then enter. <coughs> And how you should enter to the temple room? Because don't forget that they are sleeping. 
No olvidadas. Three times. In this way, gradually the sound will up. First, more sound. Softly, then little bit higher, and at the end more higher. So in that way, that means you are attract, attracting their consciousness. That please wake up. And then enter to the room and take them from their bed to the Shimhasan. Or if you are not putting them direct to the bed, you can use the curtain. So open this curtain or take them to the from the bed to the simhasana with this mantra. Uttishta Uttishta Govinda Uttishta Garuda Dvaja Uttishta Kamala Kantiyam Trilokya Mangalam Kuru. Please wake up. All the universe is waiting for your mercy. So wake them up. Then you have to do first you have to wash the lotus feet and mouth. How we are doing in our daily life, isn't it? We are brushing our teeth, we are washing our face. So by water you have to do this. You have to offer water to the deities to wash their face. You have to offer this neem, uh, neem wood, or something else, some wooden brush to them for giving them brush. Then wash their face and lotus feet. Then offer some food. Because after long sleep, they get some hunger. So early morning also we need. I am giving you complete total knowledge of bhajan. How you will follow that is in your court, your choice. Jak máme poslat je naše volko, jak, jak, jak jim opravdu chceme sloužit. Já vám ukazuju, co máme dělat. Exactly like us. How we are feeling hungry, they are also feeling hungry. Přesně jako my, když oni se, my se cítíme to, I'm telling you a very, very nice story. Já vám řeknu historii o Sanatán Goswami. Sanatan Goswami Pad used to go for Viksha. Some houses, not so many houses at the early morning, three or four houses. And from there what you will get, you will get, so you will bring it to his kutir. He will cook and he will offer it to Madan Mohan. And every day, she used to go from Brajamai's house. Or sometimes, he has to pass through that way, where the Brajamai's house is there. Every day, when he will go or he will pass that house, he will see that Brajamai is making some kitchery. She is cooking. And in a very nice way. She is using to make this kitchen for cooking one stick of nima. And 
By one side she was brushing and by another side she was using a spoon. For those who don't understand, neem trees is used in India commonly to brush teeth. Clean the tree, teeth. First, they will chew this, and after they will chew the side, go away, then it will turn as a brush. It is very useful. Also. Since uh, Aryan time, it is coming down this tradition. Still now, you can see in India, in uh, all stations, you will find. They are selling this uh, nim stick. <laughs> All rail stations you will find at the early morning they are selling this nim stick. <laughs> so the Brajavan is she used to use this stick for one side by one side she was cleaning her teeth and by another side she was using a spoon to make this kitchen. <laughs> So every day the same. So one day he asked to the Prajmai, am I? At the early morning for whom you are making kitchen? Then she said, oh, Baba, I'm making kitchen every day for my Lala. He's sleeping now, but when he will wake up, she will cry and he will disturb me for food. So just after he will wake up, he's feeling very strong hunger. So he'll cry. So that's why before I wake him up, wake him up, I prepare kitchen. Then when I get up, then I'll fresh him and I'll offer this kitchen shortly. Oh, it's very good. So you have so much love for your baby. Yes, yes. I have deep love. I have nothing only him. So next day, Hatan Goshaibad wanted to see her baby. Yes, never mind. I want to see your baby. I want to see your son. I want to see your Lala. To whom you love so much. Maybe he is very fortunate. He got a mother like you. Okay, you can come. But please, silent. Okay. He is sleeping. Be silent. Okay, okay, no problem. So Brajamai brings him to inside the room. And Sanatan Goswamipad, he could not find anyone there sleeping. And he asked, what are you so son? What is your baby, Lala? Okay, he's sleeping there. You can see. Then Sanatan Goswamipad, we found one very small bed and it was covered by this mosquito net and inside of that bed one gobal date is there sleeping. He was surprised and he started to shout, oh, he's your baby? Yes, he's my lover. Oh. So then until now you did so many a brother. <laughs> yes, you are using the same thing. You are making the kitchen without changing your dresses, without any fresh brushing. And you are using the same stick you are using for brushing. And you are using the same sticks to make kitchen. Oh my, it's a big a so he said so many things, it will happen, it will happen for this Abhradha. He said so many things. And she started to cry, Brajmai, he started to cry. Oh, what will happen with me now? Already, I, I did so many Abhradha. So many Bhagavan, until now, until 
that day Gopal was her baby but one Sanatan Goswami said so many things then she started to say oh I did so many aparath against Bhagavan Ishwar so Bhagavan Ishwar so Bhagavan Ishwar how I can get out from this Aparada Prabhu? He asked this to Sanatan Goswami Parikuta. Baba, what I should do now? Okay, what you just did, it was by your ignorance. So, from today, you just do it properly. Change your dresses, take showers, then make khichri, then wake up. But it will be so late, so wake up him first and then make khichri, then offer it to him. Okay. And Sanatana Goswami showed him how to offer the Naivetya. So Brajavai from that day, she started to do it. How Sanatana Goswami said to her. But it was very Pitiful for Gopal. He's really feeling hungry. <laughs> when he just wake up from the bed. But now he's getting khichri so late. After he wake up, then he has to wait for khichri when Maya will make khichri and sell offer. So after four or five days, after four or five days, it was a big problem for Gopal. And he was so angry to Sanatana Goswami. And he said, Hey Sanatan, you did a big apparat. Why? He asked, How problem? Yeah. Because I have to wait now for my kitchen from my Maya. I'm feeling hungry so much. Every day I have to wait now. You must go to her tomorrow and you must tell her. She'll continue like before. That is very good for me. Otherwise I'm being angry. If you not tell this, you have to be punished. Oh, Sanatana Goswami Pad was surprised to see this. Gopal also like this? In that way? So next day, early morning, he ran to that Prajmahi and he said, Oh my, just continue like before. It was my mistake that I said this to you. But, you know, Gopal, he want your seva in that way. Yes, at the very moment she is really feeling so hungry. That's why he said to just explain this all truth. He loves your seva. So just continue. He, your <laughs> so they are also feeling hunger at the early morning when they will wake up. <laughs> so that time, <laughs> maybe more sweet. <coughs> Not so heavy. <laughs> Not so heavy. Until breakfast. Uh, they will take, okay, it's okay. By the sweet, I can wait. Then offer something. Usually, in all the temple, they are offering at the early morning butter and sugar. In our temple we are offering kira, the condensed milk, not pies with rice. So we need to offer some things after waking up. Then do Mangala Yes, at the early morning, kira, condensed milk, barfi, no? Yes, not pious. pious, not pious. Not pious is with rice. Yeah. Kir is, is without rice. Ah. That means condensed milk. Condensed milk. Condensed milk. 
Bias is known. Bias are known. When you say bias, that means you are making kira with rice. And when you say only kira, so that means there is no rice. Just in English term, it's condensed milk. Yes. So, at the early morning, this light offering then to Mangala So, Mangala what we have to do for Mangala But for everything, we have to know some things to do everything. Here, how many people do you know in which direction is east or north? So whenever you will go somewhere, please check where is east and where is north. Now you are using Android phone. So in every phone you will find compass. Just do it. So, because uh, east and north direction is very important for our vision, for our daily practice. In which way the bigger we should install? The face of the date is, it will be east, east direction, like this. Yes, the face of the date is, it will be east, the best way. First sunlight, it will come to the lotus feet. And when you do puja, your face will be on north direction. And at the time of your anjik, mantra smaran, also it is very important. It must be on east or north direction. Your face will be like face will be either east or north. So, after, just remember this. When you start your Deity Seva, be set on the north direction, so deities will be on your left. From left side, there are some rules, you know, worshipping Sri Gurudev and Shiva from straight direction. All the Vishnu Vigraha, you have to worship to take them on the left. And offering pranam also like this. Offering pranam also like this. When you offer pranam to them, to Krishna, Gaura, Nityananda, they must be on the left. When you offer prana to your guru, it must be in front of you, straight, and to Shiva, straight. When you worship Devi deities, either the Devi deities, Sakti, will be in front of you, straight, or on your right side, not left side. So, here is Krishna, when you are worshipping Krishna, Rashinha, Vishnu, Itai Gauranga, so they must be on the left. So here is the perfect direction. You can see the date is face on the east direction. And my face on the north direction. So, in that way you have to sit in front of the deities and you have to start your puja. First Mangal Arati. Ajma. I have seen all of you who are not really properly doing this Ajma on your own time. So, I am showing you. Two types of Ajma is there. For Sankarpik Puja, when you are doing something with some sankalpa, 
so that time you have to do it two times Achman. The first is Vishnu Achman and then your Mantra Achman. Which Mantra you got? Vaishnava. They will do Adhara Shakti Nama, Nantaya Nama, Kurmaya Nama. No, Keshavaya Nama, Narayana Nama, Madhavaya Nama. They will do this Achman. The Sakyas, they will do Dhyaya Achman, Atma Tatta Atman, Shwaha, Paratatman, Atman Shwaha, like this. But for Sankalpit Puja, you have to do two times Achman. First, you have to do this Vishnu Achman. When one Brahman is doing this Achman, she will chant this Om Vishnu, Om Vishnu, Om Vishnu, Tad Vishnu, Param Padam, Shada, Vishanti, Shuraya, Divi, Vachak, Shuratadam. And when one non-Brahmin will do this Achman, he will say Namo Vishnu, Namo Vishnu, Namo Vishnu in this way. Three times he will ship the water and then Parampadam Shadapashant Shuraya Divi Bachak Shuratatam has to touch the eyes. Then Mantra Achman. But for our daily practice we are not to do this. Vishnu Achman. We are to do this. This Achman, our Mantra Achman. What is it? Just look at me very... Must wash your hand, both hand. Because your hand will be contaminated. So first, one spoon of water, put it here. How much? How much water exactly you need? You can put more. But minimum, one dal will be go inside that water. <laughs> Such water you have to take. No, what goes in the water? One Achaman spoon. No, one Achaman spoon. How much water? We should take on your hand. Minimum, minimum, I'm telling you. How much water minimum you have to take on your hand that when you will put one corn of dal, oh. it's the, the, si the size of like moon. Size of dal. dal? No, not moon dal. This black seeds in this uh, color. What you said? Yeah. It's black one. This black one. Yes. This black one. one. When you will put inside the water, so it will be go inside the water. It must be covered by the water. So, such kind of water you have to take. Minimum. So, First, sip. Keshavayana. Wash your hand. Then again, Narayana. Water will come down through this. Through this. Through this. Then again, Madhavayana. Then wash your hand. With Govinda, no? then you wash your left hand, Vishnu, okay? Then start your Mangalharati. I'll show this daily practice also, how we should install, how we can install the vessel. You have to do this, you have to draw one triangle. In, in two way you can do with this directly from the uh, fingertip and also you can do this like this you have to do this you have to draw from this place draw one triangle there on the ground in front of you and make a circle so you draw the triangle with the with the middle finger middle finger yes it must be by the middle, middle finger, either finger tip or finger mid. One of those, or this or this. No, 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 no. Same finger. You have to use middle finger. You can use to draw that triangle by the finger tip or finger mid. And then offer. Yes, yes. So it's like an Ankush Mudra. Yes, Ankush Mutra you have to draw. Yeah. Either finger tip by this. 
by this or to this <coughs> mid portion by the joint of your mid finger. Then offer water on three corners. Yeah, it's in your book. Uh, uh, it's in Southern Shanghai. There, and you will find there everything. Sure you get it. But that is theoretical. That is why I am showing you practical. So offer the water on the top corner. Other shaktaenama. Then anti-clockwise. Then third corner. Kurma Then to the middle with the beach. We should not chant loudly this beach. So with beach Krishna Anama at the middle. Then this has Yes, Bija. Bija, Krishna Bija. Yes, yes, yes. So, we are not allowed to chant this Bija. How we have to chant this Bija? Very silent. That you will chant by your mouth. By your tongue, you will not listen this. So put the vessel on this triangle and show this Ankusha Mudra. Look, this is Ankusha Mudra. Then make it circle on it. You should not touch the water and chant the mantra. Gangi cha yamune chaiva gudavari sharashwati narmade shindhu kaveri jaleshmin shannidhin guru. Okay? It's in there. You can look. This you need for your puja, for your anik. Both. When you do your anik, that time also you need this. When you do your puja, that time also you need this. So, before Mangala Arati, you just did this. Before we'll, you will start Mangala Arati, you have to get everything in front of you. First, we should start with Dhupa incense. Then Pradeep, light. Then Conch, Shankha. Then Vastra. Then Flower. Then Flower. Then peacock tails. And at the end, chamara. But for peacock tails and chamara, we have to remember this. In the winter time, we are not allowed to offer this. We are not allowed to offer this like summer time. Only we have to show this, just to show this. Only just show this and keep it. But in uh, summer time, you have to give them ear by cocktails and chamar. Yes. So, in this way, one after one will come. Dhupa, incense, light, conch, water conch, vastra, the rumal, handkerchief, then flower, then peacock tails, then chamas at the end chamara. And you will do two times the sound of conch at the beginning and at the end. Na začátku, Two times. Na at the beginning, you will blow the conch and at the end. Uh, yes, three times. Blow three times, not one time. Uh, blow three times at the beginning, blow three times at the end. So, by conch sound, you are invited.
their concentration. You are catching their mind. So then you should start your arati. How we should do arati? On the lotus feet, two times we have to show. Then go up to his lotus novel. You have to show two times. Then go up to his lotus face. Lotus face. Three times. Seven altogether. And after that, seven around the body. Around the body. Whole body. After you will do this arati to Krishna in that way, only you can do this arati to Krishna in that way. And when after you will do this arati to Krishna, when you show these same things like incense. Lamb, conch, to others, Srimati Radharani, Sriman Mahaprabhu, Sri Nityananda Prabhu, Sri Advaita Prabhu. You just show them until they are novel, up to that. Not under novel, it must be ever novel. Show them three, three times, after Krishna to Srimati Radharani. Three times. Mahaprabhu. Nitananda Prabhu, Advaita Prabhu, then others. Three times around the upper part of the body. Yes. But not to their feet. No, no, not to their feet. Not to their feet. And at the end, to Sri Guru Dev. Only to their face. Sri Guru Parampara, only to their face. It is Arati. But you must know our bhajan, worshipping Krishna, it must be a art. You know, arati also known as a dancing. A art of dance. Sometimes in Padavali you will find also arati and ritya. Dance. It is also dance. So you have to do your arati. It must be with some very art. Very beautiful way. Only just to show them like this. No. In a beautiful way you have to do. Because you have to attract their mind and heart. When you offer your neighbor there, it must be very nice to decorate it. Because Krishna is Rashik, the greatest artist. So he loves, we should offer everything. That is why we are dressing Krishna in that way, a very beautiful way. With turban, with nice chadar, the chadar is flowing. He is dancing with nice garland. So everything must be an art. Our seva. So when we do this arati, you remember this. You have to do it in a beautiful way. You are not showing your duty. You are showing your love. <coughs> so then, you can attract. Very important. Can I repeat this? Yes. We're not doing a duty, we're showing our love. Yes. Very crucial. Our worshipping is not our duty. It is our love. That is not only belief. That is our love. When you have love, everything is there. Love brings the sense of duty. 
láska přináší smysl pro krásu, pro umění, láska přináší láska přináší Then your worship will be an art. Otherwise, it will be duty. And by the duty, you can get result, fruit. It's like a basic result. You'll get purification. Uh, you'll get uh, good devotion, bhakti in your heart. But to attract his mind, to be a, to be connected with Krishna, with some relation, we to love Krishna. He is not only our Prabhu. He is everything for us. He is our friend. He is our child. Lala. He is our father. He is our mother. And at the end, he is our lover. So we have to love in that way. We have to feel this relation, this attachment. Then the worshipping will be completed. Otherwise it will be duty. So after Mangalarati, change their dresses. Wash their face nicely. Give them bath. Then swipe the water to fill them like you. <coughs> Maybe you, you, you see some chandan is here, some sandal pulp is here. So don't put the clothes there and just make some praise. No. We should not polish <laughs> <laughs> yes, they are dainty. We should not polish it. We have to drag their water. Very softly. Yes, there is cotton pads. Yes. And now they sell cotton with little warm water. Yes. Very gently. Yes. Like you do In a gentle yourself. way. <laughs> give them bath. Before you will give them bath. Yeah. Yeah. Don't stop my flow. Otherwise, everyone will lose something. Just remember the question. So, do it gently. You have to feel that they have also eternal body. They have their eternal body. That body is very soft, softer than butter. More softer than butter. Navarita Ningita, Komalatanu. What it is said in the Kirtan and scripture about the body of Krishna, it's Navarita Ningita. It's more softer than butter. So we have to be careful about this. When we dress them, we have to fill. In the winter time, we should not give them bath. It's cold water. We should use a little bit warm water. Like us. If we love in the winter time, strong winter time, to give us to take bath. Hanuman is very very dear. He is taking bath there in the river. Hanuman is exceptional. Last year also he did this. But generally, everyone they love to bath in the winter when it is very cold by hot water. So we have to fill it, not so much hot. We have to touch this water first, make it 
warm and touch this water. If it is very hot, so mix a little bit cold water with it. Then you can put some essence in it. Put some essence in it, then give them bath. Then gently clean them. Then dress them. Then do your puja. Puja means there is in southern Shampur you will find some bigger way but in your daily life when you are temple in your house so you can do it in a shorter way offer flower offer to less on their lotus feet how much for Krishna Vigraha Pro Krishna Vigraha. We have to offer four pair. Srimati Radharani Nityananda Prabhu, Advaita Prabhu. One pair. Sri Gauracharya, Sri Mahaprabhu also. Four pair. So offer this. If not so much. Tulasi, Vrindadev is there, so you can use one leaf to the lotus feet. One pair. One is right, one is left. And sometimes it will dry. In the strong winter, to keep them alive, the Vrindadev is Tulasi. It's very difficult. Sometimes this Durbik is coming in Radha Kundalas and Vrindavan also. By this fog, Vrindadev will die. So we have to be careful to take care of her. So then, from Tulashi Devi we can get Tulashi, fresh Tulashi. You can use also dry Tulashi. If you have no daily fresh Tulashi, you can use dry Tulashi. We have to use Tulashi for every Naivety also. If you have no fresh Tulashi, then we can use the dry. But it must be with Tulashi. So, Offer flower to the Shanta Lotus Pit. Then show them one lamp and incense. Small arati. It is known as Sringar arati. After giving them dress. Yes, one point I just means that after you will give them dress, offer mirror in front of them, put mirror in front of them. They have to see how they look like. If it is okay or not, like us. Because after we will dress, after we will come over here, Always we are going to in front of the mirror to see oh, if it is okay or not. So again we'll come over here. Oh, we'll set our dress. Oh, it is not looking nice. So same as they want to look. So offer one mirror in front of them. Then you'll feel their smiling face. Then do arati, sringar arati. It is known as sringar arati. After puja, do the sringar arati. Then offer breakfast to them. This breakfast also known as balia bhoga. It's very nice tradition is there in India. In Bengali month, Posha. Bengali, Posha. 
So this month is known there as a month of picnic, you know? And there is one tradition in our temple also, in, in month of Posha, we are offering Kijri on that time, Palya Bhoga time. With fruits, what we should offer in Balia Voga, what we'll take as breakfast. Usually fruits or something like this. And in India, in this post month, in one month, we're offering also with fruits with kitchri. One full of bread with fruits and sweets and one plate. We are offering. You know why? Why in this month? It is month of picnic. Only for that? No. There is a very good, ni na good and nice story. It is connected with Jagannath. This tradition is connected also with Jagannath. In this month, in the month of Posha, Lakshmi Devi, she will go to her father's house. So in India, also here, most of the wives they are cooking in the house. Not all time the husbands. Husbands helping here. But in India, you will find only the wife cooking. Not even husband they are helping for cooking. So, Lakshmi Devi, she used to cook every day for Jagannath. But when she will go to her father's house, father so who will cook for Jagannath? So that time mother will come, Mother Yashoda. In one month, Mother Yashoda, she will come to take care of his lala, her lala, Yagannath. So mother can feel her child. Oh, maybe he is very hungry. hungry. Like that Brajmai. When woman will be mother, they will feel their child. Oh. In front of mother, child is always child, small. Maybe they are very big. Maybe they are very big, but in front of father and mother, they are always like little kids. So mother will think, oh, my Lala will be very hungry. Yeah. That's why in Balu, she will cook quickly. But it will not happen when one will, wife will come back, Lakshmi Devi will come back. Then the you get rise 3 p.m. <laughs> because wife is wife. <laughs> mother is mother. <laughs> so mother, she will cook. For her lala, very early. One month, she will take care of Jagannath, she will take care of her lala. And after one month, when Lakshmi Devi will come back, at the end of the day of that month, Bosha, so mother will go back to her house, to Nanda Maharaj. So that is also very nice. There. When Lakshmi Devi will come back on the last day, it's known as Samkaranti, Posha Samkaranti. <coughs> she will bring one big pot of rice. One kalash of rice she will bring. So mother already go back to Nanda Baba, Nanda Baba's palace. So, Jagannath will ask Lakshmi Devi, Oh, we just go for cooking. We have to cook now. Lakshmi Devi says, Oh, no, no, no. For long journey, I am very tired now. I cannot. If you like, if you like, I brought some rice. <laughs> if you like, I brought some rice, you just take this rice. Oh, it is not cooked. No, I cannot cook. You just take this rice for your eating. That day, Bosha Samkranti, Jagannath will offer 
with this rice they will make some cake with this rice they will make some sherbet with this rice they will mix this rice with some fruits and they will offer this it will not cook so only by the rice that day in our temple also we are celebrating this Bosho Shankranti at the day of pancakes pitha and this all pitha will be by rice powder we not, uh, that day we are not using uh, the flour to make the pancakes or other, other pitha mainly the rice so that is known Balya Boga. Balya means still now Govinda is very small. Balya means small boy. So we have to offer breakfast to him. So now all of you and Sri Govinda, all of you and Sri Govinda also have breakfast. <laughs> But me not. <laughs> <laughs> so now I'll go to take the <laughs> breakfast. <laughs> Today, our Vajana Siksha class will take rest here. <laughs> okay, now you can ask. And everything is in this? Yes, everything you'll find what I just said. I showed you practically. But theoretically, you will find everything there in this book, Sadhana Sampu. So please collect and read carefully. Everyone, you need this book. All the bhajan uh, who want to do bhajan, who want to worship, everything you will find there in this book. Ask it depends on your desire. It depends on your desire. But it must be very good cotton. Cotton will be the best. So, okay. Radhe 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 Govind Radhe 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 Radhe